I distinctly remember one particular client who came to our clinic. His dog had a bad wound on it from probably a spider bite and fresh out of school, I was ambitious. I wanted to give him all the drugs that he needed and he tells me he can't afford it. He saved up for a week just to get the exam fee. And that really changed my point of view of medical care and finances and you know it's not about the money it's about making sure that these animals get the care that they need. I left that job and I went into a high volume shelter and that was a whole the total opposite of the spectrum. And I was finding a lot of animals had treatable conditions that owners relinquished them for because they couldn't afford to treat. I wanted to keep them in their homes. I didn't want owners to have to give up their dog because she has bladder stone or you know, give up the dog because he has arthritis. So that is kind of, I put those two together to figure out a way that I can treat animals that still had owners, still had homes, and make sure that they get the care that they need. Um, that's kind of where Harmony came from. So I met Stephanie in a nonprofit setting, and it was the first time in my life that I realized I could provide the same high level of medicine at a lower cost, and it was mind-blowing. It, it was literally mind-blowing, and it, it gives me chills because it gave me 100% a fresh start as a veterinarian, because there's a lot of, um, you hear about compassion fatigue and, and all of those things that us vets go to go through, and it's true, and it's, it's, it's you just get into a rut and a, a helplessness feeling, and then all of a sudden the nonprofit came about, and I would meet these families that they literally were too embarrassed to go to a vet because they never had any money. So I'd see this dog at two years old and they would just be so shy and then I would be able to do this whole workup and they were like in tears. So it, it literally, I got, I got my groove back kind of with, with veterinary medicine. When Dr. Safshin and I said, and I think we can do this even better, we opened up Harmony Vet Care. So, you know, a lot of places are not run by veterinarians, they're run by just business owners. So they, they come and they tell us how to run our departments from a non-medical standpoint or a non-client, patient, veterinarian standpoint. And uh, this was a way that we could do it. And I know, I know the level of care that I give. I know the, the relationships that I can bring and that I, that I have with my patients. So it's, it's good to sort of do it your way and feel good about it and know that everything that you're doing is, comes from a good place.